This doesn't sound like so. Oh, I suck. <sighs> Just need to build up your calluses, that's all. Yeah. All right, come on. Is this it? Yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm gonna start guessing. You want to spoil your surprise now? I don't know. Is it a dinosaur? Stop trying to guess. I ain't telling you. All right. Is it an elephant? <sighs> Is it a convertible? You're not gonna guess. Is it a puppy? Is it a lot of kittens? You mean a litter? What's a litter? A bunch of kittens. Why wouldn't you call it just a bunch of kittens? More walking, less talking. Mind your step. I got it. Oops. Ah! You should see your face right now. What am I drown? No, you're not gonna drown. You gotta work on that confidence, kiddo. <laughs> yeah, keep laughing, old man. Let's see what happens. It's this way. It's worse. Your swimming's getting better. Remember now, don't just flail about. You Push gotta... the water with your whole arm. Blah, blah, blah. Glad to know I'm getting through. Take a look at this. See that deer over there? See there. Just through there, look. Yeah. I see it. Yeah. Looks like. How's that feel? Uh, refreshing. Yeah, it's not nice getting pushed in, is it? Well, actually, we need to swim through this part anyway. I got you back. You're angry and upset. I am very angry and upset. Now, come on. Ugh. You're gonna need to dive under here. Take a deep breath. Yeah, I got this. Sixth grade history teacher wanting to apologize for being a massive dick? I beg your pardon? My friend and I would argue whenever he called the Fireflies terrorists. We got a lot of detention. You know, you really need to stop letting people rile you up. It's hard when they're dicks. Point still stands. All right, got another dive over here. Where are you taking me? Sneakers? How many of those do you have? Not enough. There. Okay. Fuck it. I'm done guessing. Well, good. But, like, is it a massive comic book collection? No, wait. A new DVD collection? <sighs> yes. That's a, which one? Just, yes. How about laser discs? I heard that's a thing. Holy shit, Joel. We're here. 
Oh my god, it is a dinosaur! And it is. Joel! Surprise. Holy shit. Oh, it's a motherfucking dinosaur. King of the tyrant lizards. That's a big boy. Be careful. I'm climbing a dinosaur. Yeah, I can see that. Just don't die falling off of one. Look at me. I'm on a motherfucking dinosaur. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? Don't jump. Just climb down. Yeah, so. Oh, wasn't it awesome? It's awesome that you didn't break anything. Oh, that was awesome. What's this? Uh, it's a book. It's a dinosaur book. Okay. All right. Oh, man. You want to try it on? I do not. Hmm. You're lost. Look at those talons. That is a velociraptor. Actually, it's a D. Dionanicus. Mm, pretty sure these are velociraptors. Yeah. I mean, at least that's what they called them in this movie I saw. Hmm. Sorry, the dinosaurs are busy right now. What are you doing? Oh, wait. One of the dinosaurs is here. Joel, it's for you. Very funny. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Did you get it? It's because you're old. No, I get it. Yeah. Okay. Compsognathus. Whew, that's a big name for little guys. Yeah, they'd swarm you. Did you see that in a movie too? Actually, yeah, but a different one. See, there's a sequel. It wasn't as good. Tiny head. <laughs> Joel, look. <laughs> that is a hat on a dinosaur. Hey, 
Is this gonna be a thing? Please don't let it be a thing. <laughs> Got there. These uh, superhero cards. Seems like they were popular. I think Sarah was into those for a while. What was the little creature thing? I forget. Dime Trodon was an apex predator. What's an apex predator? The most badass predator? Huh. Pretty short for that. Wait, were you talking about me? Gallimimus's name means chicken mimic. I, who names these? Scientists. Well, they're dumb. Brachiosaurus ate 600 pounds of plants each day. Whew, imagine the poops! Yeah, there's one scene where, uh, actually one of the guys said, that's a big mound of shit. <laughs> <laughs> what is this movie, and when can we see it? Tell you what, when we get back to Jackson, Movie night. Velociraptor. Joel! This is, uh, the one you were talking about, the Velociraptor? So small. Well, don't trust the movies, I guess. Look how thick this one's skull is. Kinda looks like... Tommy. <laughs> I'm telling him you said that. Please don't. Catch it in the right light. Boom. Tommy. Whoa, this one looks like a bird. Well, actually, paleontologists believe the birds were descended from dinosaurs. Well, excuse me, Mr. Professor. I happen to know a thing or two. From a movie. Keep going. Whatever floats your boat. This does. Floats it all day. Did you go to museums a lot? Yeah. Yeah, Sarah loved them. I swear that girl dragged me to every damn museum in Texas.
Did you know this was here? Oh, you don't like it. Um, we can head back. Oh, shut up. Oh. Hey, Joel, can you name all the planets? <clears throat> My very educated mother just served us nice pizzas. Uh, did you just have a stroke? My Mercury, very Venus, mother Mars. Oh, okay, I get it. That's pretty cool. Hey, Joel, guess what the first animal to go to space was? I don't have to guess. That was a monkey. No, it was fruit flies. Yeah, in 1947. It was to see radiation exposure at high altitudes. And they lived through it. Dad gum girl, you are smart. Thanks. Did they become super flies? What? No. Whoa. Tell me another fun fact. Hmm. Astronauts say the moon smells like gunpowder. That is a fun fact. Well, wait, how would they... Oh, well, they would take the moon samples back inside and smell them later, I guess. Okay, what's next? You tell me. Uh, quiz me. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, who was the first person in space? Oh, it's easy. Yuri Gagarin. Gagarin? Is that... Gagarin? I don't know how you say it. I've only read it, so... Anyway, he flew to space on April 12th, 1961. Color me impressed. How many books have you read about this? Come on, Joel. Isn't that incredible? <laughs> Why don't you tell me what you like about it? Hmm, I don't know. People in your time, they had it easy. Hmm. <laughs> I guess relatively speaking, sure. I mean, they didn't need to go to space, but they did it anyway. It's ballsy. <laughs> ballsy. All right, kiddo. Now I get it. Where's the steering wheel? Rovers don't use steering wheels. They use joysticks. Huh. Hang on. Is this the real one? <laughs> well, considering they left the real ones on the moon, I would say no. Just a minute. If you're going into space, you're gonna need a helmet. Oh, right. What was I thinking? <laughs> so cool. How does it smell in there? Like space. And yeah, dust.
Watch your hand. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> okay. Just... <laughs> Happy birthday, kiddo. What is this? This is a thing that took a mighty effort to find. <laughs> Take it. <laughs> You're welcome, kiddo. <laughs> what do you say we uh, keep looking around, huh? There's more museum stuff over there. Yeah, I never checked out that building. Well, let's go. And just how do you plan on getting yourself over there? I want a good splash. 
We've got more exploring to do. Geronimo! <laughs> nice. Hey, who's being there? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'll open the door for you. Come on, we can't chicken out now. Bad news. There's shit blocking the door. Well, see if you can find me another way in. I'll I'll walk around the outside. Okay, be safe. You be safe. There are dinosaurs around. Ooh. Stay strong, buddy. It's dark in here.
fake animals. some animal. Well, let's get a move on. I want to get a fire going before it gets too dark. Come on. Thank you. 